Hi everybody, welcome back. Today I am going to show you guys how you can set up a Google business profile, something like this. So let's do this. So step one would be to go to google.com slash business and you're gonna click start now and we're gonna start building a business profile. So we're gonna give this a name. We're gonna name the category of the business. So this is a marketing agency. We're gonna click next. Do you want to add a location customers can visit like a store and or like an office so if you do have an office you can click yes if you don't you can click no let's say in our example we do have an office so we're gonna select yes and over here you're gonna enter your business address so here's a dummy address that i entered into my business profile i'm gonna click next so over here google is asking us if any of these addresses are already applicable to the one that we entered but if not you can click none of these do you provide deliveries or home and office visits for example if you visit or deliver to your customers you can let them know where you're willing to go i'm gonna do no what contact detail do you want to show your customers so over here you can enter your phone number or your website address uh, i'm gonna click skip for our case Okay, so as you can see that we have been verified, so you can reply to reviews, turn on chat, and do many more things. We're gonna click next, and over here, you're gonna add your services that you are offering. So I'm going to add a custom service. This is very important, especially if you have like a office that's uh, in person, and if your company is not a remote company, uh, because over here, you can add your business hours. So if you are open on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday and Friday, you can uh, select these options over here and enter the timing. So I'm going to enter my timing as 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Okay, so once you have entered your hours, you're gonna click next. And over here, you're gonna add a little description as to what your business is all about. So I added a description over here, which talks about the marketing agency that we have, the services that we provide and things like that. I'm gonna click next. And over here, you can enter the photos of your business. So for instance, let's say if you're setting this up for a restaurant business, this is where you can add pictures of your ambiance, the food, um, what it looks like, and things like that to attract your target audience. So I added a picture over here and I'm gonna click next. You do have a $600 advertising credit that you can claim it if you are also wanting to run search ads on the business profile that you have. Uh, but for our case, we're gonna skip it. And over here, essentially, Google is asking you if you would like to take advantage of the Google Workspace feature and get like a custom domain uh, for your website and a custom email address. If you're not interested in it, you can click skip. We can continue to make edits to our profile and it will be visible once all of that information has been verified. We're gonna click continue. There you go, this is what our Google profile would look like. So the next step would be that Google is going to verify that you are the real owner before your profile goes live. And most businesses get like a verification postcard mailed to their address, which arrives in about like five to seven days. And sometimes you can verify very instantly by just, you know, calling them or sending them an email. But again, it all depends on your business type. Once it's verified, your profile will appear in the search and Google Maps like so. And when you scroll down, you're going to come to the review section, which is where you will be able to receive reviews from your customers on the Google search page. And this is like very important uh, because it just adds to your credibility and make sure that uh, you have that goodwill among your target audience and helps drive more revenue in your business. Over here, uh, your audience or your customers can drop questions for you and you will be able to review it and answer and respond to them on the Google profile itself. You have this section over here where you can click edit profile if you want to make edits to any of these information that you have provided, whether it's the contact information, the local, the hours, and many more things. You can click edit products. You can also add more photos over here to make your Google profile look much more interesting. Uh, if you have an update, you can add it over here as well. Uh, so the, your customers on the Google can review the update or if you are sending like an offer to the customers, you can add that here too. So a bunch of things to play around with. We also have edit product section over here, which is where you will be able to add products into your Google business profile and integrate it into the system. Similarly, you have edit services option over here, which is where you will be uh, able to add all the services that you provide. It's one of the most powerful free marketing tools that you have because when people search on Google, they are already ready to take an action, whether it is 
that they want to call you they want to visit your office or they want to purchase from you so if you have a well optimized google business profile it just makes sure that your business is the one uh, people see and trust first and don't treat this whole setup as a one-time thing treat it as like an ongoing part of your marketing strategy keep optimizing adding more information pictures responding to the reviews that you get to keep it uh more engaging watch how it drives real results for your business i hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful let me know if you have any questions and i shall see you guys in my next one till then take care bye